<laughs> Look at Nick Miller on our screen. Good afternoon. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlog, so if you like this video, come back tomorrow. And tomorrow, and tomorrow, and tomorrow. What are we doing tonight? I don't know. We're super busy with work right now, which I was not expecting to happen today, but it did happen today. So? It is what it is. <laughs> Let's go have fun. The hurricane system came through late last night into early today and kind of was low key here in Orlando, which is way better than what it originally forecasted like a week ago. But Sarah and I just had the conversation. <laughs> We're gonna try to get back. Now, granted, not to have excuses, but we were in the middle of like prepping for a hurricane, moving our life, storing our life. We're getting back yeah. to what, as normal as we could, like going to bed at a decent hour because we've been bad the past couple days, eating better because we've been eating kind of garbage. We've just been like eating what's convenient. Yeah, which mm -hmm. is not always the healthiest. I have been slack on the running, but that's because of all the moving over the weekend plus the hurricane. Like you were still very active. I was, um, but I'm gonna go back on a run tonight. I, just, I promised Sarah on our marriage that I go on a run tonight. So, <laughs> I was like, Whoa. so even if there's a hurricane that surprises us and comes through, I'm still gonna go run. Yeah. Um, and I've not been drinking my waters, so we're just gonna get back to being our healthy selves again because we feel it. Like, yeah. Just like Hitting back us. to normal, see, yeah. even like me working, like it works that I have like the computer by the couch and stuff, but like I want to sit at a table and be like upright and I don't know, I didn't even <laughs> get ready today, you know, like it's just been... It's 5.30, Katie went to work, so we mm -hmm. won't see her till later today. And we got to figure out what we're going to do tonight. We're going to try to have a low-key night, but we just don't Probably know what yet. a resort or yeah. something. Then we'll have to figure out what resort, if I'm going to bring my running stuff to run at my resort or if I want to run this neighborhood here in Winter Garden. We are back at one of our favorite resorts. Yes. And it's just making us feel normal again. Yeah, I feel like I took a shower, did work, gonna go on a run tonight. Ooh, this is exciting. Ooh, the lobby's torn up. Oh my this kind of puts a, a damp in our plans. What in the world? gotta happen sometime right that's crazy i've never seen it like that before but just finished the other thought we're back on property back into our swing of things gonna back get back into um our normal schedules now the comfy chairs are like all over the place <laughs> i'm very thrown off should we go outside then well it's sunny still yeah yeah i got some jams going today so there's literally nobody in the pool, and we don't have our swimming trunks and we're not staying here. But I was like, you know, it'd just be nice to kind of just like lay in those lawn chairs because it's not too hot, it's overcast, and nobody's here. We should have brought our books. I actually moved them too when I was getting ready from one spot into the closet. I'm just gonna soak it all in. Yeah. Did I mention I've had a, I had a weird headache all day today? So that's been fighting that though. It's one of the like things that push us towards relaxing today before yeah. we really get back into the parks because tomorrow we might do Epcot and Friday, Halloween Horror Nights opening night. And I'm gonna work all night. <laughs> I have a big project though. It's a yeah. project, I think we've mentioned it, it's the project that's gonna single-handedly pay for our cruise. Yeah. So, you're a rock star. I just star. wanna get it done and feel good about it, so. Violet and Christina, and my jam came on. F is me. Come on, Eileen. Um, oh my gosh, I love this song, guys. It has been like my favorite song I'm playing. Yeah. Love Shack is one of my favorite songs. Um, Play Yes Juliet. Check Yes Juliet. This the rap from Holes. Come on, Eileen. They've just been playing all the good jams. 
the camera does not do justice, but it's like golden hour right now, and this whole area just looks absolutely beautiful. Sarah's gonna snag a photo right now and put it in. Boom! Oh, so these lanterns are like tied to posts. They were in preparation for the, the high winds. Yeah, wow. They're zip tied. They're not even tied. Those are hard plastic zip ties. <laughs> we are going to go to Magic Kingdom yeah. for a visit. It's a beautiful house. Oh my out. gosh, the sky. Oh I gosh. can't even take it. The park sounds quiet. We yeah. don't know the wait times yet. Weird. And we also realized just now, and it really got me in Halloween spirit like instantly. We've not been here at night since the decorations Maybe have like been not up. on Main Street. Like I know one of the days we came like right at like sunset, but to arrive at the park at nighttime. Like it feels like a Halloween pumpkin. party, yeah. Oh. We gotta figure out when we're gonna we have no idea about when we're doing a Halloween party. We know we're well, gonna do one. Once we have I go to my appointment tomorrow. Hopefully we'll have a little bit more planned for the month of September. Yes. And we'll figure it out. Yeah. This main oh, street. Oh, the confectionery smells so good. Let's go in. Um, I've never seen these candied apple and lollipop posters before. Mm. And there's cupcakes and cotton candy posters over there. Sarah's made discovery. Yeah, so. Disney's had like just like a classic cream, white, black print in the kitchenware for a really long time. Like my mom has like the apron and a, a lot um, of it. hand towel, yeah. But they they like refreshed it. I it love how really on this nice. it's got the printed black Mickey's, but it's got like raised yeah. white ones. I actually, I really like this like heat like what would you call this like a hot tray? Like hot, a tray. hot tray. We left ours at one of our apartments once. And I know. Oh, whoa. Look at these super cool tiki room ears. See you in the tiki room. I didn't realize Mickey was on them. Yeah, there's the front. There's the back. $58, which is not as bad as I thought it would be for like a fancy super right, limited edition. Right, as much as the other ones are. The hub isn't even so bad. 30 minutes before fireworks. Everything just like looks extra magical today. It really does. Like and the I'm twinkling so, lights and the trees. I'm so happy. I feel like I really like, like Peter ripens in the fall of every year. Mm -hmm. Like every year when the fall comes, that's when Peter is the most Peter. Yeah, I agree. If that makes sense. So I was able to grab a Haunted Mansion Fast Pass just on the boat over here, but it's only a 10 minute wait. So. We're gonna check and see what small world weight is and what Peter Pan weight it's is. A small world. We haven't done really either of those miles, especially small world. Um, so yeah, we'll take advantage of everyone going to watch the fireworks. Peter Pan is 35. Small world is five. So we're just gonna do small world, yeah. Small world, then it'll be basically time for our haunted fast pass, and then we can frolic and dance with love and joy. This is how I feel right now. We hope you like Small World in 20 seconds. Now, we're gonna jump over to Haunted Mansion because this is my new audition tape to be the new Stacy. Now, we're heading on over to the Magic Kingdom's most spectacular place, 1313 Dead End Drive. Haunted Mansion USA Express. Ooh. Ooh. This chamber has no windows and no doors. <laughs> Ooh, it's hot. And nobody's in this line. Everybody's passing time on things. Spiders 
tail of a rat. Call in the spirits wherever they're at. We skipped, we were gonna see if we, were gonna, if we could get on one of the mountains in Frontierland, or even toward the idea of staying for fireworks, but we're gonna head out. Yeah, because Peter has to run, we wanna go to bed at a good time, we know we would get stuck in like the end of the night rush. Which would add like 45 minutes on to whatever, yeah. leaving and extra staying that we're doing. So we're just gonna head out now before fireworks, and it'll be good. So I, I finally set up my little desk area. I am going to have it here now. I mean, I might still jump around, but just so it's a little bit more like situated just for work instead of being like lured in by the comfiness of the couch. With the kettle on, I'm going to make myself some tea. I have my check again tomorrow to see how my lining is doing. Katie just left to go get some food with a friend and Peter's going on a run. How long are you going for? Five miles. Five. Tomorrow will be 10 at some point. One hour later. The dogs are really <laughs> enjoying my sweaty self. How'd it go? Really well. It was hotter than I expected, but um, I'm really? still just as, it was a little breezy. Still just as spooked about uh, critters here because there's lots of lakes here in Winter Garden that have no barriers that I'm like six feet away from and I'm like, and there's, if we, when you leave the little like sub communities, or, they're not really gated communities, but they're kind of like gated communities. When you run in between them, there's no street lighting betw in between them. And that's like where all the miles are. Yeah. So it like was still a lot of darkness, mm -hmm. which freaked me out. Okay, the message today is a long one. Your work is going to fill a large part of your life. And the only way to be truly satisfied is to do what you believe is great work. And the only way to do great work is to love what you do. If you haven't found it yet, keep looking. Don't settle. As with all matters of the heart, you'll know when you find it. Steve Jobs. Okay, so I'm going to put a flashback clip here that was earlier in the vlog. <laughs> You don't know what's going on because it's during our montage, but Peter, tell them what you told Wilderness, me. Wilderness Lodge is my favorite resort. There's just no comparison. We can love all the resorts. Yeah. yeah. I go back to the office tomorrow. Yep. And I go back to the doctor tomorrow, yes. so that'll be good. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.